All right. Thank you. Dude, I'm, I had no idea what you guys would think of this map. I didn't know if you would like it or hate it. Um, oh. Yes and yes. <laughs> Undecided, yes. <laughs> and if you didn't catch, this is, this is day one. This yeah. is our essentially first look at it. Uh, of course, there was some in the background cleaning up of the map since we didn't have a clean save. Okay. An hour ago. Hour so you you start? Did you start with the map without the trees on it? With the trees. We with the trees. The trees. Yeah. Oh, you replanted the trees. Okay. We've been streaming for ninety-two minutes. Okay. The uh, just just so you know, the oil refinery has to be rotated about thirty degrees clockwise so that the barrels roll off the ramp straight yeah. we already know that the oil refinery is just broken we didn't rotate it we're just going to build the advanced oil loader okay yeah no it works but they, they the barrels like they don't roll straight down the ramp yeah because the barrels are directionated to so, the map i've got about right that's right viewers on stream right now and some of them didn't get the memo on what's going on apparently in our intro uh, thing so humanity kills now that you're here and you've made this map uh, people are wondering what's hard about it. Could you explain what you've done? Okay, so I've always thought when I'm playing the, the, the map that the beautiful part of the map is the side with the river on it. And that's where all the valleys are. And uh, I'm not, by no means am I a narrow gauge expert like you, Heis. Um, I just actually started liking narrow, I've been a train fanatic for 50 years, but just recently started liking narrow gauge after a trip to Colorado and a, a ride on the Georgetown Loop. And I just fell in love with it. And um, I thought to myself, well, narrow gauge is like mountains and the trains should be going through the mountains. And I like the challenge of trying to build uh, switchbacks and try to get all, you know, the industries in difficult uh, places. That's basically the premise of narrow gauge, right? So I tried to move, have all the industries on different levels. Um, you know, as a joke, I put the freight depot, I think around 800 feet high or meters high. Is it meters or feet? Should be meters. Yeah, meters, yeah. So it's 800. Yeah, it'll be in feet. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, if I'm using the ROX uh, map, it says 800 on the topographical map. Yeah, so it's way up there. Um, and that was it. And I basically, the way I did my track on my map is I made a, a dog bone loop. So it's like a two track main line, but it's a dog bone at the end. And then I just set a, a passenger train to run with nobody driving it. And I do my freight operations around the train. Well, that's really cool. Yeah. Really we decided to like play the stupid way. So <laughs> have fun watching us do your map wrong. Oh, cool. <laughs> We're going to try and figure out how to how to do it one way or another. I don't know. But that's, that's cool. And, you know, uh, it's really the same story for me as far as, you know, how I got started with the Colorado Narrow Gauge was that I, I used to be way into all the standard gauge stuff and the big boy and... That was what I loved when I was a kid, and then I came Ice to Colorado. This was a big boy lover. What I was I deep way lore. Into all this um, <laughs> and uh, you know, my granddad always loved the Colorado Narrow Gauge stuff, and that's what we uh, shared together when I was a younger kid. And then uh, you know, I got a little older, and I was like, no, the, the big steam engines are super cool. I don't know what. Why didn't he like the big ones? And then I went to Colorado and saw them, and you see the little engines slogging it up the super hard grades and you just you kind of fall in love so yeah the same story <laughs> nice nice can i get on the map with you guys or yeah yeah so uh, um, yeah i'll get okay. the details posted yes either send him the details or i don't know if you can see the. so i i gave him the role that gives him access to the chat that the other people can't see but doesn't give full access to the chats that we have regarding spoilers Perfect. Um, yeah. That's so I'm going to copy stuff and paste it. Okay. I'm a little bit of a little bit of a newbie with Discord. Well, he'll direct you to where you. Yeah. Go. Cool. M O W stuffs group. There's a he he secrets chat. That's where I'm gonna be typing. Okay. Got it. A, find the download region, which we changed to hide it from people. Okay. So then I would switch myself. That's, I, totally I, that's the reason we changed it. Right. Yeah, yeah. it's not yeah. like Steam changed it for Heist. I actually had to change it to join the people that I was playing with earlier. <laughs> so I have to switch myself to uh, the He He Secrets channel to get it? 
Uh, no, you have to click you're on good. You don't have to change your voice chat. You have to click on that channel to see. Uh, I've there. seen TL Heart pop in. Um, if I'm assuming they want an invite too. Oh, text. Right, got it. Yeah. Uh, where? Am I just lost? Probably. Like in a cosmic sense, yeah. You know, while you guys are sourcing all that stuff out, and uh, I'm laying freehand track the rest of the way from spawn, so, you know, <laughs> what could go wrong? You keep going, boss. You got this. Nailing it. I should give you guys, uh, you should try playing the completed map I did one day. It has a roller coaster on it. <laughs> it's hidden underground. It's hidden. It's it's hidden. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Yeah, it's got all that stuff. Yes, I did. It's freaking amazing. You guys are amazing. That should be the correct download region and password, I think. Somebody else go look at that, make sure I actually did that right. Please. I'm just about to confirm this massive spline that's about to lag everyone out, so I can look. <laughs> Boink. Uh oh. Lag. I got it. Uh, that wasn't no. too bad. Did I get that wrong? That's oh. not how you spell that, but you get the idea. Yeah, see, I, I lost it somehow and I couldn't find it. I don't, and that was what I remembered. Oh God, some of this is. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna have to undo some of that stuff. <laughs> you got all the right letters in there; they're just not in the right order. No, I'm an engineer, not <laughs> a speller. <laughs> oh, that'd be fine. I'm, a, I'm assuming humanity, humanity kills you, a river rat. Yes, that's my uh, Steam name. Sorry. Hillheart is a nice person on the Discord. I'd be fine with that. Yeah. Thing. If if you do want to join, I'll drag you in. Uh, up to you. Dealer's so choice. Pe people are talking about uh, derailing Thomas the Train, and and shall I spoil a bit of deep heist lore? Yes. Yes. First thing I ever coupled a steam locomotive to was Thomas the Tank Engine. Dead silence. Yeah. I'm so. Sorry. Tom Thomas was at the museum <laughs> yeah, with Thomas, and um, I was mostly a fireman at that time, and I was training to be an engineer. And I'd run some steam. I'd run a lot of diesel. I'd run some steam, going roundy round, but I'd never done any switching with steam. And the first time I got told, okay, you know, you're gonna have you couple up with 491 with the big superheated, you know, throttle and all this pain in the butt. And it was the one thing that we didn't own at the railroad museum. Duh. So if I fucked it up, it was fine, right? <laughs> So I got to dunk into Thomas, and that was that. So, so where are you guys right now? I, I see my grave, my, my tombstone over here where a guy died laying track. I think you guys have a, a version of the map where I already had some track down, I guess. Yeah, we spent you know, some time cleaning it. it. it was <laughs> oh, you, the railroads online discord and i started i was like man these industries look whack i need to get the guys on this map and play it and oh you should just ask me i searched, I searched uh, the name that was on the map on mini's work and that was the only map that came up oh uh, so okay I decided well okay they're probably just like uploading a map that they're actually playing on as they play it so i'll just download that and we can clean up all the track and stuff. gotcha gotcha Ooh, yeah uh, i i got a version with no track who who do we find that told us it was Humanity Kills map? Teal Hot. Okay. Nice. Uh, right, I'm supposed to be looking to see. It's not in BC. Okay. Uh, clown. Yeah, groundwork's down. I'm deleting bridges out that are underneath the groundwork. Um, if you want to start laying track from the top, I will follow you, and place groundwork where you need it. You know, it's funny. Uh, uh, track. <laughs> <laughs> I joined. I joined the. I'm no light track. I joined the map, and I'm at the smelter, and I'm. I'm like, okay, I must have been on this map already. <laughs> so you're not gonna lay track, clown. No, nah, you can lay the track. Where are you guys about? Uh, iron mine and 
kind of ironworks ish. I'm I'm on clean up and tree chop duty. All right, then you want to start deleting these bridges out from underneath you. I will. I'll work from here. What would you guys What would you guys like me to do? Um, give tips and tricks for how to get to the uh that one. If you come up to the iron mine, you can at least join us up here. That's a good first step. The all iron right. works because we in deleting all the track, we saw a massive sky bridge to the iron works. Yes. Pharma disapproves. <laughs> Sorry, I, that, I was trying to stay away from big bridges, but uh, I have put one in here. I had to put one. I like bridges. <laughs> I know they're not part of uh, real narrow gauge. I mean, so I'm fine with tall bridges. bridges, but when you start building the bridges such that they go over the game's actual support limit, is when I start to have issues with bridges. Gotcha. Because, like, at that point, you're kind of stacking things in a fashion that just, like, it looks ugly. Right. <clears throat> Maybe with the spline to update any updated speeds, then I can change that and go, like, the long way around. All right, Betsy is heading towards the iron mine from the divide here. See if I've been it anywhere. What we could do, I can post a picture of my completed map from Mini Zerg in the chat, and you can see how I ran things. Oh, sure, that'd be great. So, I just Clown, what's, what's the deal with not wanting to lay track? I know it's. He's ashamed. It's it's your build to lay the track on. I'll come back so, and repair. The, I'll come back and repair the poo. Yeah, he's oh, he's okay. just he, pulling he's it out. MOW. There's plenty left for him on this side of the hill. Oh lord, this curve's a bit of crap right here. I'll fix it. I can it accept later. that. It works just fine. I can accept that. If you're gonna fix it, that's good enough. I can I can tell you that the line that you ran down there with that groundwork, you need to run a second line down there because that's not suitable. With the I, would, I, will, I would not lay track try and lay the guide track on that groundwork that you've run down from the log camp. I trust in Specific, I farm, can like, you throw a switch in? Oh yeah, I see it. Does that fit in with your plans or okay. we've got a heist coming in hot. Yeah, I see what you're talking about, Clown. It it doesn't make it over the gap at the end, and yes, it cuts quite a few of those um, um, spurs well, I, off here. a fixed, little bit too. I fixed somewhat the gap at the end. You didn't bend it, you, nice. You, 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 you can't, uh, we're not getting you a switch can't, in here, no. You can't uh, fix it mid-spline. Dumb. You've got to fix it at... You've got to start from Can the top and a run, a, like run a new line down. A 90 right here? Um, I mean, we, we can also track. come on the other side of it. Yeah, I'll hit the tangent on the loop. You just like it, turn left and go down that way to the straight bit. Well, it will alter your grade if you put edits mid spline. Undo this? Come on. You've got to lay the whole spline yes. again. <laughs> Farm if you, switch relay. If you guys want to get rid of the uh, trees around the industries, you can use the treeinator. Um, if you delete the groundwork that's there, I don't know the line I took. I'm not That's a good shout, humanity. Where I think we're we'll probably going to delete it. We might do that later. Gotcha. I can see you're deleting my stone wall. Hi, I'm oh, deleting the one never on mind. the east. Never mind. Uh, never mind. Never mind. I'm sorry. I'm uh, getting this big up dumb. on the first side. I, I did the big dumb. Ignore me. <laughs> the three percent line that went down that doesn't do anything. Yep. Yep. My apologies. Because I would have had to wrap it around the mountain three times to get to the bottom. <laughs> so much for reasonable grade. Hey, I finally found track. There you go. Nice. Is it bad track? We're trying to figure out who you're looking at. Um, I was. Uh... I, I want to be nice, but I was watching High Slay some track a little bit, and I'm uh, and they was talking about a hardcore map, and I'm like, what the heck is going on? <laughs> hey, I found a little place to walk up here. If you see bad track, call him out. Because poo poo track is poo poo track. Um, I can't. I can't. I gotta be nice. 
<laughs> okay, once you're in, we can't kick you out. <laughs> we can always test that theory. <laughs> oh, yes, <laughs> I'm looking at some pretty bad splines right now. <laughs> but I'm no spline expert either. But sometimes I don't take the time to actually do it like perfect, perfect. I just get it real close. Especially with all this uh, talk of the spline update, I'm like, well, why should I kill myself doing it so perfect if I might not even be able to keep it? Yep. We're all excited for it. I'm surprised Betsy got over this one bridge transition. Oh, Betsy's pretty good with getting over bad track. It's the other locos that go, I can't do that. Yeah. Or it's the train when it wants to buckle with the weight of the train behind it. <laughs> um, Long oh, spline somebody saved something. Yeah. I'm cutting a few of these corners, Clown, to try and get a bit more height to get over those two um, problem spots. I've you got need to go wide on those feet. bluffs. If you go wide on those bluffs, yeah, I've with just a open it. enough corner, you'll make it over. You need to throw the switch in it. here? Thanks, Farmer. It's probably still too tight, but it clears it. That's a tight corner. What, I was just trying to get a good camera angle while it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose I could get a save and I could upload the current thing to Minisworg so we could see what's going on. Mm. The nonsense. To Tutorials <laughs> for laying good track. Go look at Clown's channel. I spent three weeks making tutorials that cover just about everything that you will encounter building track. And they, and they, I mean, I didn't watch them enough, obviously, because I'm still crap at it. But yeah, no, they're they're good tutorials. They are very good. Yeah, there's some invaluable tools in there. Clown definitely knows what he's doing when it comes to this. Can't leave this. Oh, who's this over here? Hi, sucker. That's me. This is my camera angle for while I upload something to Minnie's work, so. How are you going to get to the ironworks from here? <laughs> that we will have to figure out. What's the railroad's think? name again? H something yeah, something? The, the Hope, Pray, and Cro Well, I need to look at the right uh, channel. I have saved it somewhere. Wasn't it EPNS? No, it was no. The HP and S, the hope, pray, and suffer. There you uh, well, go. I was just trying case, to answer humanity kills question. <laughs> nice. Well, all the cars wrong. On the on the one that I'm working on, I'm plan I'm planning on putting a second logging camp in the valley below the iron mine, and then build a railroad along that river down here. The one that just like ends abruptly. Yes. But I'm gonna hide that with some stonework. Hide hide it with some stonework, so it looks like it pours into a tunnel or something. Tunnels? What? You heard it here first, lads. Humanity kills is getting tunnels in the game. He's only um uh how long ago did the roller coaster come out? <laughs> oh, my roller coaster. I, I... Oh, my one that has the tunnel on it. Oh, okay. I've I've had a tunnel on my my vanilla map, the stock map, um, since like January. You know the gap between the sawmill and the smelter. I just covered all that up with groundwork and used stone to make the tunnel. Very nice. Those those are my tutorials. They're not like on track work so much. Uh, I have a few tricks in there, but. Most of my tutorials are using the third-party tools a lot and not, you know, there's a lot of things I don't use it for and just make, you know, bridges, tunnels, silly things, try to be creative. Heist seems to have something against extended. Not really sure why. 
I've yet to install it. I don't have anything against extended. I was joking <laughs> about it in my last uh, with the last guys I was playing against or playing with, but okay. I think that's almost exactly what you said a month ago when Makeley asked you why don't you have it yet? I've yet to install it. I yet believe. To install it. I believe. Yeah, because uh, laziness has prevailed. I see. Laziness has prevailed. I've got other stuff to do. But anyways, I'm gonna I'm gonna hop out while I explain this a little bit to folks on stream. Cool. Can I lay can I lay some track over here? Can I start down the hill or no? Yeah, go for it. Yeah. Just so you you're gonna put a switch over here, right? I don't know who you're looking at. Uh I'm at the iron mine and you have a loop. So I'm guessing that loop I'm, I'm yeah, laying I'm trying towards to the loop. figure there out a way to get there. a switch in where I'm jumping. So like a switch off right that will then connect to the um massive yeah. fill yeah well it's just fill for now you know and i think it's going to be easiest if i just do a cheeky delete and then just reverse a switch on the end <laughs> it's uh, funny I, mean, anyway, I want to try and work up the hill that might be the right place for us looks like pharma's got this we'll figure it out <laughs> gotcha Yes, that looks much better. Can I go to the end of this line and, and continue groundwork? Where were you going with this? To the logging camp? I don't know who laid this. Is Mickley, did you lay down to the iron mine? Is the this bridge your... that goes up this... on your right as you're looking at that goes to the logging camp. Okay, this goes to the logging yeah, camp. Yeah, the, the long bit of straight flat wood trestle is for the logging camp. Okay, so you're going to... You move over to steel. Wood you're going to... Straight or flat, but all right. You gonna do a switchback or just Glad. no switchbacks? Boo! Ah, uh, only big loops. Sorry. <laughs> Them's the rules. Have the patience for stopping a train and turning it around. Oh, that's so much fun! It is cool in operations. I agree. However, these heathens have decided that loops are the way to go. Got some distance on that one. Yeah, for me that tree was in two D. <laughs> kills. Folks are asking about how did the industries move, and I figure you might have more insight on that because you made this. Right. So thanks to the help that, uh, from IN76G, who is the owner of the Mini Swerg site, he made a post in the Railroad Online Discord that explained how to do it. It was a very short post. Um, I figured it out. I made a video tutorial how to do it. And basically what you do is you have to place a firewood depot down somewhere and then go into a hex editor and there's instructions from Ian how to, Ian, sorry, Ian how to uh, find that. And then you can change just two numbers and it changes it into an industry. So it all comes down to getting the right height, the right position, the right rotation. And then you, you can have industries wherever you want. You can have multiple industries as well. I remember correctly, I saw somebody made a map where there was a logging camp above the coal mine. That's where I put the freight depot, uh, is above the coal mine right now. Oh, we know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is awesome. I can't wait to see what you guys build going up there. It's going to be great. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I don't know. It's going to be fun seeing the mixture of build styles we have. Because my build style is the most shit posty of the build styles. <laughs> Thanks uh, for taking on. that place. Oh no. Well, you, you, I saw you actually make a turn back bridge that looked okay. Mine are just, uh, I, yeah, it'll probably work, and then we'll fix it after <laughs> we derail a bunch. So. Well, I gotta try a little bit. That's my secret <laughs> cup. I build until I stop derailing on something, and then I call it a day and leave. <laughs> Good enough for a government work. Uh, replaced by good enough for the RGS. There you go. Auto. Oof. <laughs> we should we should make a tier list of who lays the best track. <laughs> um, you died one of those. It's a weird it's a weird <laughs> tie between clown and pharma, depending on if you're trying to have nice track or ridiculous track of stupidity. But if you're trying, it's a to weird tie depending on if I'm trying that day. Well, I guess. Yeah, we've yet to see you try, yep. unless it's a shit post, I suppose. Although your yard's quite nice. Whoops. 
All I know is I'd probably be at the bottom of that list because the way I build track, I'd probably not even be able to find a way up there. Um, well, someone there in the third party tools has made a little tool that will combine, basically it splits apart all your splines and then it'll combine them back together again to use the minimum amount of splines that you need. Oh, that's neat. Um, and well, on the tutorial map where I've been doing all the tutorials at, it actually made more splines than what I have in the actual map. It's like it added splines. Well played. That's very nice. So that's, that tells you how neat I build tracks because it actually, and 18%, it created 18% more splines than what I had in the map. Yeah. But if you like, and we run some other maps through it on testing, and most of the maps were between 30 and 50% reduction in spline count. That's, you know, nice. your average track layer. So that's a real handy little tool. There's still a few kinks to work out in it. Um, like it's joining splines where it shouldn't join splines and there needs to be a couple of extra little exceptions put in it. But um, the last I seen this morning when I was talking to the guy that was making it, and I'll just have a quick look so I can get his name and give him a shout out. It is Lift uh, Fake Neo is the guy who's making it. And it is a very handy little tool and he should have all the problems sorted out of it very soon. And that's in the par third party tools on the Discord? Third party tools on the official Discord. Yep, so Jared's and it's third party tools. It takes you to a website and there's a pictorial interface where you're presented with a map that's very similar to the map that you get at Minizerg. And you can even delete your splines that you accidentally put under the ground. So you can remove splines with it as well. That I love. Yes, Clean that is. That, that's cool. that's, a, that's a great tool on that one. Okay, so we're, yes, all, we're all kind of standing around here at the iron mine. Um, we're trying to work. This is the logging camp line that's going up this way, yeah? Yep, and it looks like the, the track's being laid down on top yep. of it now. I've so started. What about to the sawmill? How do we get there? Well, we start uh, laying a normal iron mine to the, the smelter route and then just hook it by the sawmill because it's right on the waterfall. Okay. Yeah, down the so do down the mark route. Start do that, or and I'll come down and start clearing trees ahead of you. Ahead of um, designated Mickey. lumberjack. Yeah, if you guys want to start do that, I'll hopefully have this switch mess set up. Um, it's going to come off in a straight line from here vaguely. Once right, I well, I'm like actually trust that we need to use my that... brain. We'll figure out how to do that, and I'm just gonna start laying a grade out this way and seeing what happens. And people say normal route to the smelter, and I've never done one of those, so. 3, 2%, 3%, what do you think? Klein says you can... 3% the entire way, you don't need to go over 3, but we also um... have, like, way wackier stuff going <laughs> up it, so, you know, do whatever. Who's just running towards me? You yep. try that from By the way, if there's anyone who doesn't point. currently have anything interesting or fun to do, um, go start emptying some industries of all their outputs. That does not sound interesting or fun. <laughs> it's for the great to But it's useful. Yeah. You need to aim here at me. Really? We have to do things the hard way. <laughs> no one? Look, no I am one? taking revenge for you not laughing at my joke. <laughs> No free oil for you. No one was going to say the great... Okay, I'm the only hot fuzz enjoyer in here, apparently. No, I already I, defended I, I myself. The, I knew the reference. I just I thought it was too obvious. Well, that's fair. I knew the reference. I just thought, since no one else was going to say it, that I should also not say it. Well, I'll just cry over in the corner by myself, then. It's good. okay. Um, it's take, in take you and your however many good, viewers so. there are. <laughs> I've got stream viewers to comfort me, so thanks, guys.
technically wouldn't know how that feels. I can have 20 <laughs> people watching. Shush. Uh -huh. Besides, I'm doing something in interesting and actually yeah. laying track uh, according to Clown's method, so... That is interesting. Just gonna watch my number. Wait for stream delay uh, okay. to be up. Okay, clown, senior clown. Um, what? What's yeah, the that's a bit here? tight. It's a bit tight. What's the answer here? Um, I'd say two point seven five. I was just thinking, <laughs> that's yeah, the just, answer. Just, just turn down the grade just a smidge and and. Because yeah, if you had laid and well, you still should be at one spline by the time you get to here. That's two point seven five from the top. Because you should still be on, you, sh work. you should still be on a single grade, a single spine. Yeah, you think I'm? Yeah, I know you're not. Yeah. <laughs> but you should be. <laughs> Whoa! I deleted the ground out from underneath you. That's what I think. You did. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Just clean swept me off my feet. You did. I say all ground deletion. This is a really nice route to the logging camp. I love it. Yeah, I only made him rework. We have the map maker's times. blessing. Yeah, I only made him make it five times. Well, so only some. Only now has someone noticed that the stream is zoomed in. Yes, uh, I still have my my monitor capture on instead of my uh, my roads online capture on because I was on Minisburg earlier. Forgot to swap it off, and uh, my monitor capture has been zoomed in because I filmed uh, that stupid texture video today. Oh, yeah, that one where you confirm that standard gauge is coming to the game. Oh, yeah, for sure. Totally. <laughs> I caught that. Absolutely <laughs> confirmed, certainly. Mm -hmm. Don't, <laughs> Don't make sure that it was posted on April 1st. The amount of people, you know, I, I should have known because conveying a message to a very broad audience is uh, shockingly difficult, I'm finding. Um, yeah, I should have known that people weren't going to get it, but yeah. I was um, still surprised. Actually, the whole game's going to be four foot one inch heckler and torch late gauge. There you Confirmed go. it was set on a dev stream. Confirmed. <laughs> it took me about 20 seconds to get it. Um, are you lying track down this? Guide track. Yeah, no, I'm about to run it over the top of it again with a different grade. Okay. Oh, Clown, <laughs> are you following my route with an updated grade? Yeah, I am. Yes. Because should you're just, um, just it's you, mutiny then. I, it is mutiny. <laughs> give, no, give, you have to do the poopy thing give, to make Glenn fix it. Give me my pistol with the one with one shot. Oh, yeah. He <laughs> wouldn't mix the track pistol. unless you did it poorly once. <laughs> he wouldn't lay track for Mickley, but but Heist though. Oh yeah, he needs help. Yeah, it's the cloud. I don't <laughs> I don't pull Mickley enough cloud need, to. Mickley doesn't need help. I seen him lay track last night, and he doesn't need the help. Oh, I've been given clout. Awesome. <laughs> yes, everybody come watch the guy who actually knows Rough. how to use the method. <laughs> oh, oh, lordy. I'm just going to have to commit re-rail. Just... I, I do appreciate that, Clown. You've made me feel better about myself. Aye. Well, it, was, yeah. it was sort of a shit. One shot. Have, have you actually gone and looked at the Minisberg to see the variation of grade you got on that? Oh, it's awful. I know it's I awful. I don't care about that. Variation of grade that happens on the real no map. on on the poopy track map. Oh, the one you refuse to play with us on because you're busy air quotes busy. with okay. real life air quotes. I was whatever that is. That we we watch battle bots every Thursday. Oh my god, I love battle bots. Yes. Yes. Uh, yes. We watch battle bots every Thursday, and uh, it was the this corners tight penultimate episode. Oh, we watched that, fun. and then. Uh, and but then there's a couple that, of bits watched, of groundwork here that have to go. We finished watching Invincible, which, if you haven't seen, is a because brilliant Amazon Prime show. But they interfere with the transition I just put in. Okay. This last Thursday's BattleBots was amazing. Dude, it was great. Oh, every fight was amazing. I I love BattleBots. Yes. Every every segment of a guide track must be full length track. That's no, right. No one. Yeah, uh, segments. Yeah, full. I've been I segments this whole time. Well, no, I guess I'm gonna. God track is full length segments. Otherwise, you can't set the steel bridge to it. 
How can that be? Can't I just do every other every other guide point then? No, because then it's too long. <laughs> oh, I see why. What percent grade is this going up to the logging camp? Six. I Six. Think? Okay. Yeah, my, I built a switch back to the logging camp just on the east side of this mountain. That's a six percent. You should have heard our arguments about that. <laughs> well, well, six is fine. You can you, you can use um you can use the C seventy with eight logging cars, and you can bring them up. And then going down, you just got to use a couple of handbrakes. Oh, for for the educated folk that are on my stream. You might recognize the song that's playing in the background, kind of, because it's from the Railroads Online soundtrack, but it's the first demo of my band playing our version of it, because I wrote it for the Railroads Online soundtrack, and then my band heard it and said, we should play that, and I was like, okay, Oh, he's... and then it, it oh, got is that, heavy. Um, is that Slide Tune? No, it's not Slide Tune. Slide Tune was the other way around. I wrote it, um, wrote it first, and it was originally a train post. I've got an earlier version of the version that's in the soundtrack. Uh, but it's got oh, forty six whistle plastered all over it, which was fun. Um, but that turned into a Hellbot song before it was in the soundtrack. Whereas uh, night night job, which is now uh, backdoor burn house for Hellbot, was originally <clears throat> written for the soundtrack and is in the soundtrack in game. And I'm, we're listening to the the heavy metal version on stream right now. So fantastic! Where has Betsy gone? Hey, uh, yeah. By the Iron Mine. Hey, clown. One second. Are you laying a whole bunch of track right now? No, I'm putting in groundworks because that transition oh. didn't work for the simple reason okay. that Heiss has three percent that he's putting yeah. in. It's not. Yeah. It's not three percent. No, of course it's not. I was just saying we should move the switch back a little bit and kind of smooth out this because it it would really make sense to move the switch back another uh, sixty to. Yeah, we're already doing a switch. I thought we agreed not to do the, those. The switch, it, the switch object will move back an amount of distance. <laughs> yeah, you can, you can move this, the right. switch further back onto the bridge and put a better transition to that six percent in if you need it. Um, is that. it the end of the Thank world you. if I've been laying uh, full length segments along this whole thing? Nine, nine tie. Yeah, yeah. is that gonna, is that gonna be an issue for the guide track, or do I have to go relay it? I honestly, actually, no, if you connect to every second, <laughs> um, ish, maybe control point. Now, if you connect to every second control point, you'll still get the guide track in there, but you can't go to every one like you would with if you were putting full length. Yeah. Okay. Nice, nice work on the logging camp. I guess you figured out that you have to do car to car with the logs. That what now? You gotta. Finally, someone's been to go see my truck. Yes, it's beautiful. That's exactly how I went in in the same same manner. Oh, transloading. Is that what you were talking about? Yeah, you gotta. Uh, there's two tracks, right? Yeah, right. Transloading. Is that what you call it? There's a word for that? <laughs> car to car. Somebody yeah. told me it was transloading once, and I've been using it ever since. I could be wrong. Oh my god, look at this big freight yard up here. I'm back down by the iron mine. Uh, yeah, I just like built some crappy lane somewhere. <laughs> you still have your <laughs> XP from <laughs> because this was your map. Oh, I do. Yeah, I gave that to myself. I got $56,000. What do you want me to buy? Nothing. <laughs> okay. You guys you guys want to earn it, right? Uh, yeah, I believe so, yes. <laughs> see, see it's, al it's also possible uh, that we're just telling you not to buy anything on camera. <laughs> what happens off camera. Gotcha. Mickley's a filthy cheater, uh, but yeah. Though. Look, I, I mean, am he's a the one filthy constantly talking about saver. railroads online extended. So, yes, I I am a champion for that for that tool. I, I love it. Paid and I'm already simping for it. I love using railroads extended. Yeah. 
There are, there are times when I don't, though. I really only use it for uh, the speed indication and surveying routes. I don't use it for building or anything. Right. I use it to build, like, quick. You know, I can build things really quick with it. Like, I did this HK map. I built the whole map in one week. Double track, mainline, all industries connected, everything. It's because I was able to fly through the air and just lay my groundwork without having to lay 50 million pieces of groundwork underneath it just to get to the one where I need it. Yep. Did Heist die? He hasn't talked in a while. He's probably talking to his chat. Yeah, he wanted to go talk to chat. Uh, so it's just a case of me not paying attention. Got it. He's answering some chat questions and mutes his <laughs> microphone on us when he does that. Because <laughs> we have a habit of like not shutting up. You know what I'll do? I'll run. True. I'll run a line from the refinery to the oil fields. All right. The oil. There's something resembling a yard at the Iron Works now. I wouldn't call it a yard, but you know, there's lanes. You happy with the switch now? Just refinery. There we go. Now you've got yes, a line all the way down there. That's a single spline. And I'm going to delete most of Heist's, whatever he made this is. Because <laughs> I'm not sure where he was going with this. Where did he go? Not a clue. Any quick? Oh, of course, he's not actually listening to us either, so he can't hear that he that he's gone the wrong direction. <laughs> <laughs> just go, oh, just he, go over and I, jump in front of him until he notices. And oh wow, hasn't he gotten steep? His um he didn't hasn't checked his grades as he's gone to the end of the spline and clicked it in. And this is like six almost seven percent here. Are you trying to keep uh under a certain percentage without all the track? Um, um well, we only have a quarter right now, so something we can drive on. And yeah, well the line that I've put to the Iron mine, it's it's easy, very easy to put in at three. And well, that was what he was meant to be laying was a three percent, and he's um gotten up to almost six. Can I? Um, I need to mute up for a hot second here. So I'm actually deleting his line if he's um listening yet i think he's just accepted defeat and is probably standing in the forest somewhere he's at the um sawmill by the looks of it anyways uh, i'm back from my uh showing the stream some of my band's music <laughs> and i'm just deleting the one you put in now? that's all well yeah i figured you'd be doing that I figured I'd lay it as close as I could and then let you delete all of um, it. So. How, did, how did you get up to the 6% at the end? I had 6% at the end? You were at about 6% yep. by the time you got to the end. I'm not sure how you did that. I've before, never been before you more right click three. You had before a constant you grade got... and you didn't adjust it as you finished. Yeah, you've got to... Um... Do the constant grades all adjust as you go along? Yeah, that's no, they'll all go off grade. Do it because they're all constants. Oh, and when you, it's you not a bridge thing, on, it's a on, constant. It's a constant thing. I thought it was a bridge thing. Okay. Uh, well, it's, that, a con it's a constant thing. That makes a heck of a lot. No, what, what actually happened was he started off 0.0001% off on the first piece, and it just grew after that. No, it actually <laughs> you, you, you get to 6% in, you know, 300 feet with... Accounting, you know, increasing only 0.001. <laughs>
Now, as soon as you go around a corner, it's all of a sudden you've gotten an extra degree around a corner. <laughs> and yeah, you you must correct your about that. grades at the end of your before you right click. You lift it up once and put it down once. And oh, correct any grades. Are you guys going to rotate? You're going to rotate this refinery. Or you're going to leave it the way it is. Leave it. We have the technology of advanced oil loader machine. Okay. <laughs> farm is too strong. Yeah, did, did you see? Yeah, Pharma does things to train cars. Did you see what happens when you turn the refinery 90 degrees? No, I've, I've not seen any of the things. Yeah, every other one gets launched forwards. Uh, like the football. Yeah, on my friend's map, it was everyone. It gets kicked off like a football, but you know what? It hits the car every time. Hey, can we get a save, Heist? Uh, not yet, not yet. Give me, like, two seconds. All right. Well, you can get another uh, save uh, in two seconds. Now you can save. Uh, all right. I'm sure you all felt that spline coming into existence. I did. Judging from Tristan's oh, yes. reaction. Yeah, I felt uh, the cars of this moving locomotive felt it. <laughs> Sorry, not sorry. So I have a question. Okay. Ask away. Um, also, to who's asking? It's wings. Oh, this is wings. Okay. Uh, so QMA has mentioned that um, we'll be able to connect up the three splines in the procedural switches. But how exactly are the points in throw gonna work on that that is a brilliant question that remains to be seen i I've... tried i tried to ask some more detailed questions about that and i unfortunately got answers of translation issues <laughs> for lack of a better term mm -hmm. um just like the single and dual sl slip switches he didn't know about so it's yeah we're going to have to kind of see, I think, the first beta of how things work out and then explain, no, that's not how this should work, and then yeah. get get there from there. Yeah, it's going to be a fix in time. Are you laying track of this? Because what nope. I think is going to happen okay. is, because I've seen three-way switches that have two sets of points Nested interlaced. Nested points, yeah. yeah. Like, what I would do is just default that to a stub, just because that's what was more common on Neuro Gauge, but... Yeah, yeah stubs. Think, We'd have to get stubs, those modeled first. Stub, Peyton is working on stub switch models. He is. But I think the stub switch models are going to have to be... I mean, that's going to have to be a, an item that's placed. Peyton's yeah. been talking well, about way to making the stub too. switches for way too long. I mean, if you if you're already... Negotiating procedural ties and switch stands and uh, blades. Central rail thing. Then, then you could you could make it stubs. I mean, there's not much that's different in from a coding perspective if you're already manipulating the way it looks. Uh, but you're right. An object of stub switches does make more sense intuitively. Yeah, because depending on the angle of the third track that you place off it, the throw at the point that it places the switch stand might be too far out or too close. So it's just like it would have to recalculate that position and that would just get really complicated. You is just trying to give everyone too much power. Well, so <laughs> We're not ready for time, dynamic. At the same oh. time, he's, he's working on kind of a nudging system uh, in general and uh, <laughs> let, let me, uh, let me g give you guys the questionable feedback we got today and see what you think. Not a single oh boy. <laughs> hmm. So, he says he has finished the auto connect feature when joining spline ends. It uses the leave tangent at the end of piece, and it will automatically set your starting at the end of your new spline. So, if you have two loose spline ends, this feature will create a smooth transition between both, so no more fiddling around. Okay, I already see a problem with that. And it already raises more questions than it answers, doesn't no, it? No, I already I, I I understand exactly what he's done, but the problem is the last segment that you've placed on the previous spline didn't comply to the curve of the spline. Well, 
I'm not sure. We'll have to see what exactly what he's got with the new system because he said that he's got perfectly circular spline curvature segments implemented. So you should be able to have a perfectly curvy, perfectly circular curve and finish that. Yeah, they're the ones. They're, they're the ones that are basically from segment two through to segment end minus one will be a perfect circle. Yes, I'll agree with that. But that's just the way splines plays. And there's no way that he can possibly get around that mathematically. You're talking about the last segment? Yeah, the last segment he plays a reference. That's right. It doesn't have a point of reference to basically kick it around the corner. And normally, if you want to continue on around the corner, you've got to delete that last segment and connect. Well, at the moment, you overlap, but you'll have to delete the last segment and then connect to the second last end. I mean, unless he's programmed it to draw, based on the previous curvature, another point at the end to kick that end out, which is possible. The, from what it sounds like, it sounds like drawing a perfect circle means just like, like it will just trace an arc around a calculated center like axis of rotation and just end the curve just along that arc and then wherever you build off of that you know it's i don't, I don't know it's it's something i'd have to see it's it's one of those things where we really we can speculate all we want but we need to see the first yep. edition of the building tools and then provide feedback and we need to well, provide yeah. like really robust good feedback right away if it's not what we want or not what we think works so yeah i think procedural uh crossings and diamonds is definitely a good idea I that's, still that's think brilliant. stock switches is the best way to go. For I that. I also agree that stock switches is going to be better. Uh, QMA is not convinced, and it was his his point was like, well, we'll see what it looks like, and we'll see what the community thinks. And uh, if you can snap them, to, if you can snap them to the grid, you can make that exact same switch by snapping the points to the grid. True, true. So I don't know. It's a uh, and yeah. well, the only problem with that B would well, be seeing the grid so that you know you're connecting to the right point. Is the grid invisible or can you see that grid? You can see the grid. Yeah. It's adjustable so see. that you can see it. Okay. Yeah, if you can see if you can see the grid, you can recreate the objects, which is no problem at all. You can see the grid, you can adjust You'll the size just... and the angle of the grid on the fly. You can adjust it from I think it's one centimeter to a hundred centimeter resolution on the grid. Um, and you can adjust it by a uh, degree of angle. So you can go yep. in singular degrees. How far do you want to adjust the grid? That's and you'll be plan. able, yeah, you'll be able to make copies of your switch, but you'll have to have a notepad there and you'll have to write down what numbers you used if you don't have a good memory. And then the other thing is that um, it sounds like the sp uh, splines for the diverging route are either drawn freeform or drawn along a curve. And the issue with um, like stock switch geometry is that it starts with a curve, but then the diverging route usually will have a tangent component to it. But will procedural switches still work if you have a spline break um, halfway through before it leaves the fouling point of the tangent track? Hmm. That, well, that's, that's a case where idea. you would have to just build further and then turn around and delete segments off the end. Yeah. So, that the, so that the piece goes in exactly the shape you want it to. I think we're just going to have to see what that turns into. Like, Is I, this I don't... track up here by the logging camp good to start building track off of into the logging camp? Um, Have you got steel bridge uh, that you're building no. on? No, You've it's have a not. Steel... You've got to have a steel bridge there, and the, all of the um, stone walls got to be deleted out of the way because the stone walls got randomization in it. And if you want a proper grade, <laughs> I mean, you can build it if you want to, but it's going to get replaced. Yep, guide tracks going in. Yeah, I, I am. I am I'll nearly down. Somewhere else and find something else to do. I'm building track at the sawmill, or building 
groundworks at the sawmill at least. Yeah, we had, we had some uh, <laughs> we had some trees go particle accelerator. It's fun. I haven't had any. I've cut down a lot of trees. Well, I cut down a some that to. were uh, that were stuck in the sawmill industry, and that made. Fun. Oh, okay. Yeah, they'll fly. But yeah, it was beautiful. You guys yeah. aren't good enough for the powerful flings like I am. I have um, ah. fifty five hundred XP and. I haven't had any trees go flying at all. It's been very disappointing. Are you guys planning to build a line up the river? Not yeah, sure yet. Yeah. Obviously. Yes, there was. My first save. I'm going to build one. The, this save is going to be a coal mine. Yep. And oil fields. Hey, hey. Well, the logging camp's there, and it's uh, not the logging camp. The uh, Sawmills there, and it's got a supply to everything down there. So there's got to be a line run down the river somewhere. In in my uh, personal Discord, I have a separate forum just for the this map, and in the pin messages, I have the blank map, and then also the map that's complete. So if you guys ever want a blank map but no trees, you can go in there and find it. Uh, we had a map with no trees. We planted the trees intentionally. Right, I understand that, but you had, you had like, you guys got a download of the map, like, halfway through with the rails and all that other stuff. I have a, I have a map with no rails on it and no trees. Yeah, the map with the trees and no trees that we have, we deleted all the rails off of. Right. Yeah, the I only rail that was left existing was the grave. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a guy died. Uh, I'm spying. <laughs> a guy. The groundwork that was at the industries, and I touched up the refinery a bit because it was missing some groundwork. But aside yeah, from that, like everything's been done. Well, yeah, the, I have crashed. That was a big spline. Big spline. Yep. I froze up pretty good there. Yep. So. Might want to save. Give me a it, second. It why? to me as well. Yeah, Mickley, don't leak the password when you join back in. I I am working on figuring out where to place my blocker, such as to hide it. Just turn off your stream output for that. Yeah, thing. all you gotta do is just turn off your... It's turn got the little the, eye the, symbol the on little, game. Yeah, the, the eyeball, yeah. Just turn off the eyeball. Come on, Mickley, and you call yourself a professional streamer. Hmm. Seems to act like it. I do not call up. myself a professional <laughs> streamer, and I've forgotten the password. Oh, it's uh, yeah, no. that what what he said. Yeah, that one. Quickly, Com start naming the, passwords noticed, we don't I use. I noticed there was lag earlier. Did a bunch of people crash out while my shit was muted? Yes, yeah, I got crashed out. Oh wow! Well, I dropped out. I didn't do anything on the host end, so that's a case of. Oh, I spawned in and I just see like tens of trees flying. Huh. Okay. Uh, I'm streaming that. this also. Is that okay? Yeah. By all means. Cool, cool. Don't, don't leak nothing. Nope. I have a splash screen that I enable that covers up. Nothing. So leak something. <laughs> <laughs> nothing is something. Double negative is a positive. Yeah. Oh, if you can... If you can see nothing, you've seen something. <laughs> I've seen that it is hot today. I'm turning a fan on. Jealous. What is hot? 18 C. I, I, I know, know only wet. rain. Yeah, I only know <laughs> wet. Rain. That's not hot. It's flooded like 20, 28 C here. Prize and flooded basement. When will your drums be back together, friend? Yeah, yeah, Mr. Tropic Region. Uh, this my, is Portland. My, my drum kit is still a mess behind me because I haven't had a chance to put it back together. Yeah. Tragic. It's that streamer life. <laughs> that streamer life. Uh, it's that stream. Uh, it's that having too many things on your plate life, which is just what I exist as. So. Oh, so many trees. Oh, now they're flying everywhere. Yeah, you'll need your drums someday, and then then they'll be back together. Yeah, no, so I do want to do a, a music stream. Somebody said, like, hey, could you record a, a stream of you playing music? And I was like, that would be brilliant, but I can't do it with my stupid audio box. But now, 
I can send the output of all of my audio box into my second audio box and have that streamed. Oof. So I have you can the send the output now. of the box to the box that I sends send it to the to thinking box. box. Yeah, that sends it to the thinking box. So um, that's totally possible. And I've, I've got, God, I've got like six or seven original tunes that I've had in my head recorded uh, shittily on a phone or whatever, like ready to go that I've just not had you know, 15 minutes to slap down and mix and everything. Man, so. We need RO Volume 2 already. Come on. Well, we got seven tracks, and Wings and Strings has <laughs> uh, produced, I think, 700 uh, bluegrass <laughs> tracks at this point. So. No, I, I have. Um... Oh, he's been pumping them out. <sighs> yeah, it's good stuff. You, have... you've, you've pumped out enough that you got Peyton concerned. Peyton was concerned that your right. slope creep was too large. I got a DM about it, and I was like, <laughs> so, of course, no, you is, if a, a fly, a a fly more song. The thing is, if we want day night cycle, we need at least two hours for night. So I've, the, I've just the thing. The on thing that. is, I was I was pissed that I only had like two and a half hours for the whole soundtrack in general. If we want day night cycle, I want like at least three hours for each if we can get there. And we have a couple tunes that'll work for night in the existing one but uh what you've been doing is better so yeah Aww. we've got a long way to so, go so peyton was mad about two hours <laughs> well the the thing about um the night music that makes it probably a bit easier to put together is that it's not a whole bunch of tracks it's like your main instrument maybe one or two accompaniment and like a it's low very, drone very much a yeah quick piece it's not a it's not a whole orchestra or band or anything it's just yeah one of those quick ones yeah because like the the most recent one i did the cold frosty morning falls of richmond i was able to knock that out in a day so i listen to that fairly constantly I, I that's good that. stuff that was brilliant and i, I do I, I hear a bass part in my head and yes peyton was being a dick about me putting bass to it but I had anything you would like to add. A dick or um, angry about something. I'm fair game for it. So, I'd like to try it, and I'll leave it up to your final governance because it's something you composed. That is, that's a rule that I have as a musician: is that if it's your composition, it was your like guidance that got the tune there, then you should have final say. It shouldn't be my final say as the guy that's just coming here to be the producer and mix and master the stuff. I'd like to hear what you think, but yeah. Be fun but to yeah, to so. yeah, I'd say like if you want to try to add a bass on, I, I think I could hear bass in that. Oh, yeah. Um, I could also potentially um hear like in the Falls of Richmond portion, um sort of like a sort of like Civil War like snare drum, like marching drum kind of. Oh, that could be thing cool. for it. Just to give it sort of that like. I've uh, got a. Um, I could try and put a. Um, I have a uh, an old marching drum as my rack tom on my kit. And I could try and put snares across it, and that would get a good sound. But ooh, yeah, that would be fun. I love the music you made for the game heist. It's awesome. I was listening to it so much, though. Like I'd wake up in the morning after playing the game, you know, for eight hours, and hear it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> my, my, only, my only sadness was that, like Kume was like, "Hey, I, I kind of need the soundtrack," and I, it, and he gave me like two or three weeks' notice, and I was like. Well, I've only got 28 songs done, and I was hoping for like 50, but okay. So nice. We're doing volume two, but yeah, we'll 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 get to those kind of numbers eventually. It's just a matter yeah. of just getting it down, because like with the uh, again with the stuff I do, I could knock it out fairly quick. Um, and Peyton said uh, he also wants to do like sort of like minute long harmonica tags, almost as like palate cleansers or little breathers. Yeah, between so the, do those those so, little yeah. solo more stuff. harmonica harmonica if we have someone who can actually put harmonica not me taking a zillion takes and then cutting out the best bits you know that'd be great um, I, I can play a little bit so um i, I, I think I, I can but i have harmonica on my keyboards i can sounds pretty much like a real one well if it's if it's if it sounds genuinely real if if it passes the highest ear test then okay can go with it. Um, I've, been, I've been playing keyboards for 50 years so Oh, Are you I'll building back up. uphill with that bridge? I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it. No, I'm coming back to the you, top. If you can get, if you've yeah, got I'm waiting here for you to. I'll start deleting the humanity kills. I'll take yeah. on it, but I the stone wall out right from underneath you along the way. Yeah, stingy piece of shit because I kind of am. 
That's so, that's uh, good. That's good. I got a guy in my Discord saying that he has some country western organ music, including Battle of New Orleans, uh, by Crewmet in the Discord. I'm not sure if you've seen messages from him. He says he's tried to message you before and has resorted to making me call your to your attention. Um I'm not sure if I've seen messages from them before. I'd have to look. But um yeah. I'm assuming that he has tried to contact you and is now going through me. I would, I would I'm not 100% no, but, on uh, it. We could, we could, we'll chat on it offline. Um, I'm going to tab out and answer some questions on my chat, and then, uh, and then I'll be right back. I am deleting beams. <laughs> Just throwing it away? So anyways, you guys want to hear something cool? Yeah. yeah. All right. <laughs> I, have, I have done uh, the streamer milestone of uh, convincing someone to get, send me money on the internet for the first time. Wow. <laughs> what do you mean? You got you got subs? You're saying? No, I I I've been throwing in uh, just this little nod. Um, I've been I made a throwaway PayPal account just to see if this would work, and somebody finally chucked money at it, and I find that hilarious. Oh wow! So you just like, and so it wasn't wasn't through Twitch. It was just no. It's just a PayPal account I threw together, and this bridge is not going to work. Um, and it's just I've left it in the all the video descriptions just to see what happens. Uh, it's, it's got a message like "Buy me a pizza" with the PayPal link, and somebody finally donated uh -huh. to it. <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> Thirty bucks. Hey, that's that's awesome. Awesome. Which is nice. Exactly. So uh, I deafened up and made sure to give him a shout out. Yeah, cheers. Come on. <laughs> Thank you. That's really cool. You're yeah, awesome. I, <laughs> uh, honestly, it feels really weird to receive money on the internet. It does, right? Yeah. It, I mean, to someone like I'm. Don't interview me think. in groundwork. Oh. Anyways, uh, Heist, I made money off the internet. He's gone again, but yep. we're proud of you. <laughs> okay. Uh, never mind then about Heist hearing about it. I was I was proud of myself. I, I made something somebody liked enough to give me money. That's really cool. <laughs> Now, are you streaming on Twitch as well? No, nah, just YouTube. I don't. I don't want to have to deal with Twitch as well as YouTube. So I'm just gonna stick to YouTube and maybe right. highlight episodes. I don't know. Right. Because this this is at least the plan, as far as I'm aware, is we're gonna be doing this uh, weekly, and then I figure at some point during the week I can create a highlight video of sorts and chuck some music over it. Oh, sweet! Yeah. Oh, so you're Wings and what's your name on? I am Mickley. Mickley, okay, on Discord. Uh, I think, yeah, yeah, and I. No, I am Mickley. Uh, and on YouTube, no, you're not Farmer. No, Shut up, Mickley. <laughs> I know Farmer. I know. I know Farmers and Clowns voice. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't you been talking too so much. Right. It's a heavy Australian accent. Yeah, Australians. Clown, how bad is it if I miss a link on the guide track? Not, what not that bad, right? This? You miss a link with the bridge. I think I missed two, but I couldn't really tell. You miss a it's link, a not... it's over. It's terrible. If it's on a straight, who cares? If it's on a corner, you're going to have a wobbly corner. Well, I mean, this is... I'm putting in the bridge. So there's going to... I have to redo all the alt stuff with the nine tie segments after I'm done with the bridge, right? Yep, down the, down the center of the bridge. This is to get the bridge in the right spot. That's what this is for. Okay. And this bridge is getting deleted after anyways and being put back in yeah, after it, the final track is in. Yes? It it will alter the grade if it doesn't follow where the track goes. And then you build on it in a different spot because it's got a wobble on it. And that'll alter the grade. So you won't every every time you step off the center line of the bridge that you put down, the steel bridge, it will alter the grade. Okay. If you can stay right in the center of the bridge, you'll get a perfect grade that you've set all the way from the top to the bottom. 
but when laying the the final bit of track over this bridge it's uh you, you use alt lock and then just follow like in the middle follow right the, yeah follow the center of the basically keep the ties in between the two rails the side rails okay so are I you doing that tell... back from the bottom or no from the top oh so you're behind me i didn't even see you come past i mean i it's probably going to go in two splines honestly yeah i'd, I'd say three bridge don't go that long i'd say three mm -hmm. splines with the length of this track so i just got to make sure remember to up and down it a couple times yeah right before you right click to make sure that you are actually on that six gotta like tape my finger off of my mouse so i don't right click by accident you're now entombing me in an engine shed because uh, I was not specific enough in my my requirements. <laughs> I'm in housing you. You're in housing me. Well, that's fair. That's 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 a fair take. You know, I figure the price of housing has gone up so much that um, yeah. You know... If you could provide me with a free engine shed, I would gladly take it. If a locomotive can fit inside. Hey, hi. Yes. It's free real estate. It's free real estate. <laughs> so uh heist do you want to hear oh, dang it i screwed up the dang it dang it dang it i missed the link and i think it was a bad miss on the link so uh one second let me process this okay so aside from mickley's brain fart uh in theory the uh the thing and thing was going to happen in about six minutes and uh, are we just gonna not or what's the deal there yeah well we're nearly up three hours on here so my my thought my hope and dream and and I t always said that the big event that we had been referring to was going to be a tentative time theoretically around nine. I was hoping we could deliver a load of logs. If we're within delivering a load of logs within the next half hour, based on our track, then I say we keep going with this. But if we're not, I say we save and we go to the other. Thing. I don't think we are. Yeah, I don't think we are. I'd have to cut, get in like, and start not only track. is the like track not even laid, the log car isn't even loaded, or at the industry is nope. meant to be at, and it has the longest distance in the game to travel. I feel like a lot yeah. of tracks laid. Re-upload re a mini's work. Let's see what we're missing. <laughs> we ready for another big spine update? All right. Go for it. Re-upload the mini's work here. Ah, uh, it's killed me. Oh, no, it didn't. Oh, nice. It had. I'm still alive. Um, right. Uh, before I brain farted and it was just a visual glitch, actually, and I didn't have to end the spline, but I ended it anyways. Uh, Heist, I want you to be proud of me. Yeah? Yeah. I... Good job? Yes. Somebody paid me money on the internet for the content I've created. Look at you. Well done. Yes. First time. Yep. You know, it has one and a pizza. <laughs> <laughs> well, it depends where I get the pizza from. With two toppings. Well, see, with, with $30, I can get at least four pizzas with two toppings. Oh, not from there. Don't eat that pizza. Yeah, no, pizza don't. Oh, that's not real pizza. Whatever pizza that is, it's wrong. I was yeah, thinking they, Domino's, they, but okay. And you're still wrong because I just got one pizza from Domino's for thirty dollars. So, say, you know, well, they have a they have the you the, buy the the, the medium uh -huh. two topping pizza for like six bucks. Uh -huh. the, the the sticker price versus the delivery price is a yeah. very different thing. Oh yeah, look, it's I, like I seventeen get, bucks thirty dollars later. Thanks, Domino's. No, nah, no, nah. I can get with out of twenty bucks, I can get two medium two topping pizzas from Domino's delivered and still have a little bit extra for tip all in the $20 bill Dom Domino's but is it pizza okay back into the stream folks and double check me but I'm failing to see what we're missing other than the logging camp spur to run a train of logs and the the transition from the switch to the logging camp um, because the whole line is laid. We well, just there's need... there's a bit of track that I've deleted to put in a new bit of steel bridge, but technically you could go up it. It's just not finished. Oh, I see that little bit down there. 
Yeah, the, yeah. This is this is guide track to Snap Bridge Two. So there's three bits of track. What do, what do we think, viewers? Viewers, do you think we finish the three bits of track, run some logs to finish off this stream, and then move to the S and D, or do we not? Let's do, do we continue to build it properly, or do we cut shortcuts and just connect it up and drive up a track that's not designed to be dri driven up? There's well, we, the question. Well, that's a slightly different question, because, I mean, we'll still... Uh, well, that's look, what it is. Clown, These tracks clown, got, here's, uh, here's the thing, not Clown. It's designed to be driven on. This, this track that's not designed to be driven on is still better than Heist's track. It is <laughs> most definitely better than Heist's track. <laughs> oh. All right, well, everyone, that's fired. Everyone's saying let's run the logs. I've not right, seen connect, anyone say otherwise. Connect them up at both ends and leave the track flighting. <laughs> Put me inside yeah. a sand dipper, you <laughs> asshole. <laughs> Somebody else does need to go put in that extra bit piece of track that I've missed because I'm currently laying more bridge spline to properly lay this line. Like, we can properly lay it later. We'll That's there, fine if you want to run off of it. But there is a bit of track missing. You want to go connect this end of the line down to the bottom yeah, entrance? And yeah, I'll, I'll, go back, I'll go back up and fix his bit at the top that he's missing. And what about that line that runs down to the sawmill? Is that actually connected at the bottom? Um, before we like start all heading off in separate directions, is anyone remotely near the iron mine wanting to go start getting Betsy cooked off? Yeah, I'll be right there. In the goddamn Tristan's building. only got about 10 oh, pieces man. of track to lay in. Yeah, are, you'll be able to do it. Are you stuck in the science sand house? I'm stuck in the sand house. Somebody come delete the fucking sand house. <laughs> <laughs> that's, another, that's another thing. <laughs> the delete facilities button. She's the delete facilities button. Yeah, that's no, a... oh, the menu because I'm inside of the damn fucking sand house you put me in. Yes, you can. You're, ob you're obviously on third person view. No, Go I, was, back to I first went to first-person view. First view, and I could not press the menu button. Ice, why would you code the game like that? Why would you do that? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Part of the game is just inadvertently discovered how to put someone in uh, gay baby jail. In gay baby jail, yeah. Yes, this little have. bit here is going to be interesting. <laughs> now, if you had railroads extended, you could just teleport. Well... That's another uh, another point for Rose Extended. <laughs> <laughs> I have so many points now, Ice. Please just go Railroads. <laughs> go install that, huh? It's fun. You are a Railroads Online YouTuber. Just saying. Yeah, I'm still not going to use it. <laughs> I mean, well, Khan's the biggest YouTuber. doesn't even use Miniswerg, let alone Railroads Extended, so... Clown, it is acceptable for you not to use extended because your track is good. And like you actually take the time to know what you're doing in terms of operational things. Oh, I gotta say though, flying's pretty cool. It is. It's very it's very helpful. It's easy to build on the side of cliffs when you can fly. Yeah, yeah, yep. It doesn't matter as long as you're having fun playing the game, that's the important thing. <sighs> This is a long route all the way up here. This would have been like twice as far if it was three percent. Oh yeah, you would have never got there. It would have been impossible to do it without a switchback for sure. Oh, somebody's taking Don't that, say that out loud. Challenge. Pharma will hear that. <laughs> Pharma already tried to do that, so I mean, I do mind. still have the plan of the zero point two five percent save on the new spline update on this map though uh you ain't doing it on this map i could do it on this map yeah you can do it you will i don't think you'll get to the freight depot you could, i can i can get down from this logging camp at a three percent and keep it at the they, side of they, the mountain humanity kills they could find a way yes it would be very stupid long impractical and pointless but they would find yeah it would be, be a long way right you it would, it would be a would long way I should I should offer up a reward. Anybody who can get to the freight depot at zero point two five percent. All right. On this map, <laughs> you gotta, you gotta <laughs> make. I'll back it. You'll back it. I will. I will match you whatever the bet is right here, right now. Uh, I'll buy you a Domino's pizza. Oh no! Those are yeah. <laughs> Domino's 
<laughs> two with two. No, no, one, one, one with two toppings. <laughs> little Caesar's sticker peels I will, off. I will, I will put it up. If humanity kills won't put it up. I'll put it up. If you can make it 0.25%, I will. If you can make it 0.25% from spawn to his location of the freight depot, I'll give you a hundred bucks. A hundred? Wow. Ooh. Oh, he must have a hang real on, job. Hang on. Uh, real talk. <laughs> job. Is that for anybody who does it or the first person to send you a save with it? is about first, to leave the game. First person who sends me a save that's done it. Right, let's check your DMs. <laughs> <laughs> track builders hired. Yeah. yeah. Using the in game building tools with a video proving it. There you go. Oh, yeah. All right. You know, Heist, I, I, I think you're onto something here. You sh we should do like monthly track builder challenges. It's a bounty. I a bounty. See, the last time Heist offered someone a hundred bucks, Hello, he's managed to, to find that way over here. That's true. Oh, I owe you, you a hundred bucks for that, don't I? I don't have that. I didn't expect that. That's I did that because I. Hi, Tristan. To. <laughs> I could, I could, I was trying to do this for you earlier. I'm sorry. <laughs> I was trying to get to the freight depot using 5%. I had to go seven. What is this? I've now encountered the floating track and it's confused me. It looked very steep from the underside, but. It is. It's 6%. It's steep. It is steep. And when I'm one, running up a 3%, it looks like a 9%. You know, you know what the funny thing is though? This track is ridiculous, but it's still not as ridiculous as your lead out to the coal mine from your iron one. Well, Oof. you know. Or that Georgetown loop that, nonsense. That, that, that was a perfectly fine railroad. <laughs> I don't know what you have a problem with. A railroad, nothing. Your rendition. Mm. Well. Yeah, Georgetown is 3%. And I slated it at 4 Oh, Christ. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of people in the Discord in their regular channel waiting for us to start. Let me, let me go brief them. All right gonna mute my yep. mic on on the stream because i'm gonna be a smart man lame sorry discord people but uh the chat insisted is this being streamed on discord uh no the discord is where the people for the next engagement after this map would like to join so it's being opened up to anyone that joins the discord oh okay switch, switch, set ES switch. go set the switch someone go set that switch anyone Trying to um, get there. the line is currently in the foul up to the pass because i had an issue with the bridge uh six percent being a lot different than how it's supposed to be with the guide track. So we're going to have an issue there. You're going to be just fine. Just lay it quicker. You guys. Well, the thing, it's in the foul right now. Yeah. And some of this track is really not you fit will not, to go on. That's right. You will not get up this track that's had the bridge put underneath it. You will have to be deleting pieces out of the bridge and the, and the bridge will have to be built again from the top down. Well, I already have to rebuild this section of the bridge because it was not correct. There's a lot of people. This is the most people I've ever seen in a single Discord channel. You didn't drag <laughs> me down into this mess, did you? I don't no, hear I anybody. No, I'm, I've, I've come back up. <laughs> the streams of the damned. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I would, Discord. I would put a rule that they have to be on push to talk, because otherwise just the collective ambient white noise is going to be... Like, <laughs> well, here's the thing. They're already in the wrong channel. They're meant to be in like one of the bottom channels where that is set up. See, we are not actually able to even general. make it up this hill, so... Everyone get out and push. <laughs> We're not even at boiler pressure yet. Calm down. Why would you start up the hill without boiler pressure? I'm going to say your safety's not going, so... Because we're close enough to it. Like, we got to 90 by the time the water came up to temperature, and after that, you can just throw the reg to 100% and it'll be fine. We didn't stop. We just went mm. slowly. You know, I'm probably going to hop off here. I'm in uh, Eastern time zone, so it's getting late. Thanks for hanging out. It's a lot yeah. of fun. There we go. Have now we're at pressure. Yeah, the safety's on. You. See you around. Yeah. Yeah. I'm also east. After I'm done with this spline, I'll probably go too. Thank you so much for coming in. Seriously, visiting. it was so cool to Which have you come in. Someone? Uh, I'm no, so cool to be here. I'm deleting the whole of the bridge. We, uh, I don't know where the junction was. We talked about doing Which this junction? every week, uh, so we'll see in the future. Thank you. So there's a bit of the bridge where... There was two splines. 
The second spine ended up going into the ground once I corrected the grade, and I didn't want to not be able to delete it. So I'm just going to redo it. It went Probably. that far into the ground. Yeah, it's just one one spine segment. So I'm, I'm going to redo it. I've marked it off. But I'm just deleting the bridge, and they can deal with the tangents. I'm going to go down, uh, and once they pass over, I'm going to see if I can't uh, nudge the points to it get the further right. out. Up here where I'm at, the rail sinks under the bridge. Yeah, I'm deleting the whole bridge right now. Yep. Did I just pass you? Is that you I passed? Yeah, okay. no, that's me. All right. And then uh, I'm probably just, just going to stop streaming and head off and go make 0.25% uh, to get 100 bucks off a of heist for free. <laughs> um, Definitely just money motivated. Uh, nice. Uh, get, re get ready. Uh, get ready. I'm. Go ahead. Where are we supposed to start to get to the freight depot at? To, uh, I said percent? from spawn from to spawn. the freight depot. From spawn. And the main, okay. main you light it up on the mini zig. If it's over two point five, that's a max length spine. I just oh, laid. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> That was a max length uh, spline from the refinery down to the river. 1.5%. Oh, engine just smeared. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I got a line from the refinery all the way down to the river. Done. Awesome. Nice. All right. That's awesome. Loading, loading back in. You reload. So, nice. We need to try <laughs> some of the rules about this challenge. Um, sky yeah. bridges, yes or no? Hmm. You just... Sky bridges are at the judge's decision, but if you have pretty long bridges that are not like relatively purpose built, uh, we're discounting it. The, the bridge, the bridges shouldn't be doubled. Sing, single height. height. This is important since you're running the train now. You have to be careful because there are some curves where they have tangent rails in, and it will derail you. Yeah, I see one ahead of me now. Someone wants to fix that. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not running. Like I'm, I am I'm doing this because I can in. pay attention as I look at truck and I'm loading load. back in. Okay, got it. Ahead. Uh, attempts I'm, are being made. A a head, a head, a head, a head. Attempts uh, are being made. <laughs> I see that. Uh, the the engine said off. no. I do have a port. We are sliding you're backwards. Roll, you're rolling backwards to the start and trying again. I know it's going to go. Maybe. <laughs> okay. You want to do uh, the with the last yeah, let's do it. All right. I've I've tied the rear. Roll back into me. Okay. Now go 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 go. Huh. That may have just worked. It's nope. thinking about it. You sure? All right. Come back again. Easy. Really easy. Just barely kick off the brake. Real slow. Okay. That's now right. Go. When was go, the last go, time go, you go. saved, Mark? Um, you should save. Save right now. Save now, yeah. I don't want you to lose this spline I did. This is a good one. Hey, hey, there we are. That's the ticket. Momentum trick. All right, I'm gonna you run out of hand. I'm gonna scout for your uh, your bad splines, I suppose. I need to zoom out. I've got my got the same darn thing going on again. Will the derail count remain at zero? Remains to be seen. Also, I cannot believe how many people are in that Discord chat. I've never seen how many <laughs> human beings. I in say that got replaced chat. for the mess. And you let them know. I I, I hopped down there and said, "Hey, about twenty more minutes. Tune into the stream." So. Um, All right. So apparently, there is a new person that has the MOW role. Who is this person? Layton. Leighton Ader? Uh, oh, Leighton. oh, Leighton. Leighton. This, is, this is Leighton from the Tech Tree shitpost video. This is Leighton yes, that I, I lived with Leighton. So I Leighton. know who Leighton is. Yeah. I hear a train. It's a uh, chugga chugga. Oh. oh I, was I, can see it. I can see it a million years behind me as I'm running up ahead looking for tangents. 
Yeah, I'm also running down from the top looking for tangents. I didn't There's check the track. There's in, 56 it, people in the chat, so we're going to be able to have 64 on the server if we're able to have 64 on the server. I don't know <laughs> if we'll be able to find Mark, out. What server region? <laughs> it's going to be Denver, Leighton. Okay. I have, to, I have to change my own, so don't worry. There's going to be a Might little bit of an overlap between streams. And I think... I think the, uh, the 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 big shit post stream is gonna switch to Twitch just because it's just gonna it's just gonna be a thing. I'm just gonna crash your internet. It's just gonna crash <laughs> everything. I just I realized think. I don't have Twitch. So I should probably download that. No, Twitch is Twitch is a, just a website to view a stream. Yep. You don't need, just you go don't online. Need to have it. You could just watch okay. it at twitch.tv if if you want to have the stream up separately, which you might. Um, um, we're gonna try and have people in separate voice channels and stuff. But, <laughs> with that did, many people. Did we, did we make a decision on if one of the other people here was gonna be hosting, so it's less bad? Hello, I just deleted um, a tangent. No, I, I mean, if, well, if you deleted one, then we should be okay all the way at the top. Yeah. Um, I don't think we made a decision. Um, I'm happy to host just and see how it goes, I guess. I just mean if you're streaming, then well, who's going to have less frames in that many people's so server? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know how that many players interacting affects the frames is the thing. Oh, someone should be recording this momentous occasion. Just thing, if someone else is hosting, then, you know, that just opens the opportunity for Heist to disconnect from the stream because it's horrible. Uh, by the way, which server? Sure. I presume it's Heist's server? It will be, yeah. Okay. Not there yet. Got it. Yeah, we're not there yet. We're, we're still finishing up our current playthrough right now. Gotcha. Alrighty, I'll be hanging out. Yeah, oh. I think we're gonna at least get, um, good old Porter to the logging camp, maybe, and then hold there, because going all the way to the sawmill is gonna take forever. Yeah, I think I think that's okay. If we can get to the ported to the London camp, I can abide by that. We have six of us on this train right now. Nice. Yeah. Hmm. You guys are adding a lot of load. <laughs> We're bogging pretty hard. Could you get out and walk? I I can push on this brake. That'll help. That was forever ago. It was like a stream year ago that you filmed with those people. It is. Hey, uh, Mark, you know that Dusty's got a friend at the COG? <laughs> Dusty's friend Jimmy at the COG? Yeah, yeah, Jimmy from the COG. You know the COG down in Colorado Springs? Uh, yeah, that one. Yeah, the, the one COG. That I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do a video with him about how COG railroads work? Yeah, that guy? Yeah, you might be uh, doing a video with him, I don't know. Oh, fuck. He's in <laughs> Leighton's house. Yes. Hi, Jimmy. Hello. We, we are currently having the Temple of Nerddom for the train show weekend. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, you, you said he was going to be there, and I spaced that, but yeah. Hi, Jimmy. It's been a minute. Just a bit. I'm trying to remember when the hell we actually last saw each other in person. Yeah, it's been a while. It has. I, I, I want to say I saw you and Nick at the museum, maybe 2019 or 2020, maybe? No, for, right. for, for 20s rollout? Tw yeah, yes, 20s. yes, we yeah. were there for 20s rollout. That was the last time, but that was like five seconds and it was COVID, so it was all scary and stuff. So, so question about this whole $100 challenge thing, Heist. Does the track have to look good or does it just have to get Betsy up there? It's got to be at least Heist track, so it doesn't have to look great. But it shouldn't be super shit posty at the same time. So wait, if it's heist track, it doesn't have to work either. If it's heist track. It doesn't have to work. <laughs> 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 Top delivering, or being able to deliver something. Not necessarily delivering something, but being up at the top. Good Christ! Okay. This, this is this is where the logging camp is now that I'm yes. finally up here and seeing it. This is the top of the wall. You madman! <laughs> this is you see but this is beautiful. Look around. You can see everything. How the hell are we gonna do this? This is one of the tallest mountains on the map, and you put the logging camp up here. That's where all the logs are. What can I tell you? <laughs> Thank you. This is genuinely <laughs> really 
excited for our future play playthroughs on this. Because, I mean, this is literally one of the tallest maps, or tallest parts of the map you can get to. And yeah. And now we've got to build a, a rarit up to it. And we built that mega long 6% to it. So that's ridiculous. Just brilliant. So yeah. I have. I, I have. First to load something. On I have In terms I, of loading cargo, so y'all can suck it. I have. Everyone loves you. <laughs> no. Yeah. Everyone loves yeah. you. Yeah. Everything. Yeah. I got news for you though. The freight depot is two hundred meters higher than this. No. We know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You look. Yeah. <laughs> It's right over. Right look towards, there. look towards the waterfall. It's it's above the coal mine. There it is. Coal mine. Yeah, this this was. Near the edge of the tree. You can see it. There it is. Oh yeah, no, I can see it. You can see the the weirdly rendering stuff in the trees right where my crosshair is. That's the that's the freight depot, and it doesn't look that much higher. But yeah, two hundred. Two... Maybe a hundred meters. Maybe a hundred meters. Two hundred feet. Yeah. Or a hundred feet. Yeah. Sixty meters. Sixty meters. Yeah. I believe. Yeah. So anyways, this was a brilliant first hardcore playthrough for us. We're gonna try and do this on a on a weekly basis. Oh sweet. I'm gonna be the pain in the ass that makes it tough to schedule, but uh we're gonna try and do weekly playthroughs on this and see what the MOW crew can achieve because Lord knows they did better work yeah. on all of this tonight than I did. And I'm so, just here so, to bring you the story. So, ideally, I will be streaming at some point during the week when we have time at random. Um, possibly. Uh, so again, this is just spitballing. We haven't discussed this, but I was thinking that maybe I'd be streaming with some of the MOW crew during the week when Ice isn't available, just to get some of the off-camera work done. So, like getting that bridge in and the actual line built to the logging camp, so that's nice and proper. And yeah, just I am fixing Heist's track. Totally, we don't know how that is. We, we come back. We come back from uh, from camera breaks, and my track is just great. Yeah, I'm, I'm great for that. So, magic, <laughs> magic. <laughs> it's a... notified when we're doing that sort of thing. Go ahead and join the Discord. There is a content notify role you can sign up for. Yes. Uh, uh, if, the, the if you want, you can go sub to me. Too. Sub, sub to Mickley. <laughs> Mickley does a lot of good streams too and, and has a lot of good content. And also check out Clown's channel as well. Clown has been giving us great Rarids Online tutorials. Yes, I haven't if they do not know how to build track, come have a look at my channel. If you want to fix the wrongs that I have done, uh, yeah, go watch Clown's channel. And then uh, as well, he's done some playthrough stuff, which has been brilliant. So anyways, uh, go check those guys out and we'll see you all next time. But uh, if you I saved the game. I'm saving the game. Uh, if you guys are here for the big ESD open night, uh, we're going to switch over to Twitch pretty shortly here. Come join the Discord. Come join the voice chat. It's going to be a bit of a shit show to organize. Might be a minute, but before we're live on Twitch, uh, but uh, we're going to get things rolling here quite <laughs> shortly. So thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.